I'm going to show you how to make a delicious coconut cream that I call cocoa cream and this time as opposed to one of my other videos I'm going to show you how to make it from this. Stay tuned. In another video I show you how to make coconut cream from coconut milk and my favorite brand for that is Thai Kitchen. The last couple times I bought it though there hasn't been much cream in it and you have to refrigerate the coconut milk but usually you should by the time it refrigerates you should have half a can of cream. I was getting like a little bit of tiny cream so I emailed them and they said you know what it depends on the coconut and where it's grown and blah 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 blah. So, I tried the coconut cream this time, so I want to show you the easy way to make this. I use it as a topping instead of dairy. So the good thing is you don't have to refrigerate it. You can bring it right home from the grocery store and start with it right away. And this is my favorite brand for doing this. And the dog is making a lot of noise right now. So what you're going to do is open up the can and there's some liquid and some cream in here, but you're going to just spoon it into a bowl that you're going to use a mixer with. Now I have a stand mixer, but you're only going to put the solids in there. So scoop through some of that liquid and pull out all the solids you can. You can save the liquid to use in a smoothie later. Now what I add to this is one tablespoon of vanilla extract and one teaspoon of maple syrup. Then I use the whisk attachment. You can use a hand mixer for this. I wouldn't use a whisk. Use a hand hand mixer or the stand mixer with the whisk attachment. Turn it on and put it on high and you only have to beat it for one minute. Don't overdo it because you don't want it turning into something weird. Now the other interesting thing is I've tried this with another brand of coconut cream, the Trader Joe's. I saw Trader Joe's coconut cream so I bought it but as you'll see in this b-roll um, it turned into something that was really weird because after making it and refrigerating it it should still stay nice and creamy but instead it became more like coconut oil it was gross so I tossed it so yeah the Thai kitchen brand is what you want and I like to use this as a topping on some of my chocolate desserts that are also on my YouTube channel. Here I've used the cocoa cream to top my raw vegan mousse. I also have a vegan mousse recipe hmm, that I'll link to over on the right side. Click one of those images to check out those videos. Our mouse over the upper right hand corner, a little eye appears. And if you click it, you'll see some other videos that you might be interested in watching. And thanks for watching. Bye.